Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, February 20th, partakers through God's promises, whereby are given unto us exceeding great and precious promises, that by these ye might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. 2 Peter 1 verse 4 Every promise that is in God's book holds out to us the encouragement that we may be partakers of the divine nature. This is the possibility to rely upon God, to believe His word, to work His works, and this we can do when we lay hold of the divinity of Christ. This possibility is worth more to us than all the riches in the world. There is nothing on earth that can compare with it. As we lay hold of the power thus placed within our reach, we receive a hope so strong that we can rely wholly upon God's promise and laying hold of the possibilities there are in Christ, we become the sons and daughters of God. He who truly believes in Christ is made partaker of the divine nature and has power that he can appropriate under every temptation. He will not fall under temptation or be left to defeat. In time of trial, he will claim the promises and by these escape the corruptions that are in the world through lust. To make us partakers of the divine nature, Heaven gave its most costly treasure. The Son of God laid aside his royal robe and kingly crown and came to our earth as a little child. He pledged himself to live from infancy to manhood a perfect life. He engaged to stand in a fallen world as the representative of the Father. And he would die in behalf of a lost race. What a work was this! I hardly know how to present these points. They are so wonderful, wonderful. By his life of sacrifice and death of shame, he has made it possible for us to take hold of his divinity and to escape the corruption that is in the world through lust. If you are partakers of the divine nature, you will day by day be obtaining a fitting for that life that measures with the life of God. Day by day, you will purify your trust in Jesus and follow his example and grow into his likeness until you shall stand before him perfected. Our Father cares, February 20th.